Okay, so I'm very honored na sa akin na napunta itong pag-direct ni Penduko. I've seen the past films and the comics. And what I love about Penduko is... Uh, kasi ako po, hindi nyo na itatanong, before I became a filmmaker, I was a culture worker. Wow. So... Um, <laughs> May reaction. <laughs> the pressure of the so well. Um, ang, ang talagang thrust na ginagawa ko nun, using film or video to promote Filipino culture, especially sa hometown ko sa Pampanga. So now, after doing a couple of romance films to you know break through the industry, I want to uh, get in touch again dun sa side ko na yun, na using media to promote culture. And ang kagandahan sa Penduko, he can really be a platform to serve that purpose. Kasi diba, napakalapit ng world dyan sa Filipino folklore, sa culture. So, that's my vision for Penduko this time around. To reimagine him as uh, a character, a comic book character na magugustuhan ng current generation and at the same time use him as a platform to promote Filipino martial arts, culture, folklore sa bagong generation. So, kaya I'm both excited and overwhelmed nito sa project na to. Because you know me as a filmmaker doing all these romance dramas. Uh, you might see na parang bakit siya tatalon siya sa ganitong genre. Um, sa kaibuturan po na aking puso, mas malapit po ang mga ganitong genre. Sa, kasi po, sa ganito po ako lumaki. This is the first time, di ba? Um, I did the horror film na medyo may ganyan sa ibang studios. Pero yes, it's the first Parang time. Parang fantasy talaga. Opo. Oh, okay. Full-on fantasy action. Yes, yes. Uh, yes, I can consider it my first time. Yeah, and I'm very excited. Pero direct, originally, di ba, it, it was dapat, hindi ikaw yung original na magdi-direct dapat. Oo, oh, parang Nagpalit, di ba? dalawang directors oh. yata. Oo, oh, oh, oh. nagpalit. Tapos, uh, tumawala si James. In fairness naman to you, ikaw dyan talaga dito kay, ano, kay Mateo. Nagpalit, uh, matra si James, ikaw ang pumalit. Oh, kay James? Si Mateo. James. <laughs> James. 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 Ano po yan? Sorry. I think so. It's the biggest. It's the most challenging. Uh, epic in scale. I'm very excited. Kailan yung start ng Right now, I'm still finishing the script. Kasi ako rin po yung writer. Uh, nangangalahati na po ako. So, tignan natin. Siguro, uh, uh, hopefully, this year pa rin mag-start. How, how different is this from the three... Uh, may tatlo na kasing nauna. Dalawang Jano at saka yung Efren Reyes Sr. So, anong kaibahan mo? Um, yung mga, sige, let's start with the Jano Gibbs version. Uh, it's more of on the comedy side. Meron pa rin naman comedic elements itong reimagining ko ng Penduko. Pero I want, I want Penduko to look cool sa mga millennials, especially. Mm -hmm. Baga, I want the millennial, the Filipino millennials to see Penduko as a character na hindi mo siya pagtatawanan lang. Hahangaan mo siya the same way that we uh, look up to all these superheroes na galing sa ibang bansa. Ganun ang vision ko for Penduko. I'll just cut it short for a while. This Penduko movie is a project of Viva Films and Epic Studios. Produced by Epic Studios who's also a partner of Signals. Okay? We'll bring in a new director also. He's the action director. IP, IP. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, IP. Jason. Okay. Just give us some brief explain the state of culture. Or a culture of culture. Like NCCA. Um, I was very active with the Maria Center for Kapampahan Studies. Oh, in Pampanga. Yeah. 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 Yun, mostly ang ginagawa ko nang talaga gumagawa ng anything kapampangan, yeah, film, short films, music and, uh, videos. Bye, Bas. Bye, Bas. Bye, 
So we'll stop the questions first for now because I'm sure you want to know. We already know some of you have been whispering about it. We'll show you a quick Okay. <laughs>